Hi, you are welcome to my channel of Smart Polished. Today, in this section of video, I will discuss about how to get the minimum number, maximum number, and the summations of a series of number without using any optimization function. I'm repeating again here the restriction is you should have to find mean max and the summations without using any optimization function i mean you will not using any free defined function maybe short it maybe some uh, sorry maybe mean maybe max or not like that so how to do the code i already like uh, did this code before so actually what happened i will now discuss this code line by line so i'm paste i'm pasting here the code so what happened i am taking the first user input so user will give the space separated input of integers so let's see suppose we will give the user like this type of input 7 5 8 9 6 3 0 4 this type of input will give in maybe so now i am defining a functions in this function suppose that gets the function name actually function name make it uh, good then it still looks good yeah so in this function name uh, iterate will be start from one that's why i take one so mean max and sum all these things are in a list and the list previous values is zero why it is zero because if the user will not give anything then mean equal zero max is equal to zero and the sum equal also zero that's why i'm taking the mean equal to max is equal to sum equal to zero after that what happened while i less than equal length of the list so in that case length of the list so what happened in this case when you will do when you will uh, go for the input will given so after that what happened in the input when up to it is not reached up to that level because it is started from zero after one after that i am incremented the iterate here so until unless you will not get uh, uh, goes to equal the loop will be iterated one by one so what happened for the first case when i is equal to one so first input what happened if list of i so inside the list of i if it is greater than the maximum values then max is equal to list of i what is the meaning so what happened in the i case seven will come at here so list of i mean 7 7 is greater than maximum maximum is what maximum is previously maximum previously is now let me understand maximum previously is 0 and minimum also previously it is sorry it is 0 and sum also it is previously uh, 0 so when the seventh element will come it will check the 7 is greater than 0 yes 7 is greater than 0 so 7 will be the maximum and if uh, 7 is less than minimum i mean 7 is less than 0 no so minimum will be 0 and sum equal to 0 plus 7 it will become it will become 7 in the second case when the 5 will come at here so 5 we will check 5 is greater than 7 no so 5 is uh, uh, here here uh, 5 yeah 5 is uh, less than of minimum no so 5 also it will uh, it will uh, goes as a sorry it will be value will be overwrite first time sorry sorry minimum x maximum will be same and summation will be same and second time when the 5 will come so minimum in this case 5 is minimum of 7 so the minimum will become 5 when the 8 will come so 8 is greater than 7 so 8 will assign to the maximum value and like this way and 2 will be skipped it and here actually for 5 5 will be added so 5 plus 7 plus 5 is 12 and when the uh, 8 for 8 will come so it will become 20 after that when 9 will come so maximum value 9 is greater than 8 so maximum value will be 9 and it will 9 will be check also minimum that 9 is less than 5 no so it will be skipped and for summation 9 will be added to the sum so 20 plus 9 it will become 29 so like this way this loop will be iterate after that what happened it will return the mean max and sum everything so what happened in this case every time the last value will be assigned so mean for 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 this 9 up to here so what happened maximum is 9 
minimum 5 and the summation is 29 so if we run this code completely this code so it will give something result of like this way so what happened i am returning the object declare here is equal to i'm calling the functions with using the number now the given list is i'm printing the given list is like this way and the minimum is this maximum is this and summation is this one so let's run the program and understand more better so give the input at here in the console that 7589 suppose 7589 when you will give let's see the output your given list is this one minimum is 0 maximum 9 and summation is 20 you got the point i think so it is the best way so i think you hope you understand so how to find the minimum maximums from a number without using any function so if you have an alternative solution please put the, your command or the solution in the comment section below and the help the other guys and i will inform you that please subscribe my channel like my videos the reason for that in this session at the last i will discuss about some hiring challenge so let's follow this hiring challenge as well hope you understand and have a nice day. thank you bye